So I've been receiving many questions regarding um, asking and not receiving the manifestation process, how best to pray. And my answers are still the same. God answers prayers that are more specific than those that are general. So he doesn't go from person to person asking them what they need. It's impossible to go through 8 billion people daily. So what does God do? He creates a law to guide requesting and receiving. It doesn't really matter how close you think you are to God, how good or how bad. The laws do not favor anyone except those who understand it. So you could be a good person and still you cannot receive from God. You could be a bad person. Whatever you call yourself, you still ask and you do not receive. So what is the best way to ask? A lot of us are thinking that asking or praying is when you kneel down. But it's not really so. It's just part of it, but not really true. So you are always asking. Whatever you are thinking, wherever you are, whatever that is going through your mind is what you are asking. If you are thinking about what you regret, if you are thinking about what you don't like, if you are thinking about what happened in the past, and you keep thinking about it, keep thinking about it, keep repeating the thoughts. The laws of God will think, oh, this guy is asking for this thing because that is how the laws are meant to work. And what will it do? It will give you that thing you're asking. And why do I say this? Why do you think you asked for a bread and you got a stone? It's because you kneel down for five seconds and you ask for bread. And when you stand up for the rest of the day, you are thinking about a stone. You will manifest a stone. So it's not God that gave it to you. He didn't like discriminate on, sorry, he doesn't discriminate on who he answers. He answers those who pray exactly as the law commands. It will give you exactly what you ask. So you will attract a stone instead of a bread. So it means be careful what you think about. Now, it's impossible for you to know what you are thinking about at any or at every point in time. So what do you do? Billions of thoughts come and go. We don't want you. The laws, the universe doesn't want you to Focus on what you're always thinking or be conscious of it. That would be too much. Rather, you should be watch your mood. Are you happy right now? If the answer is yes, keep thinking those thoughts that are making you happy. It will raise your vibration. It will raise your frequency. And then you are more likely to attract the things that will keep you happy. Are you feeling bad right now? Then get away from what is what is it you're thinking that is causing you to feel that way. That is the shortcut on how to uh, comply with this law. So watch what you're always thinking. Most of us believe God has abandoned them. That God doesn't answer their prayer. It's not true. He answers 100% of prayers, especially if you pray in the manner I just explained. Whatever you're thinking about is what you are asking for. Just go and note it. Write it down somewhere. Note it at the back of your mind. Whatever you are thinking about and you continue to think about that thing so frequently that you add emotions to it, whether good or bad, it will manifest. It will manifest. You can take my word for it. So be careful what you think about.